Now, Sianda Damini is an Afro-jazz artist who hails from Mandeni, a small town in KwaZulu-Natal. Now, the artist attended school and was born and bred in the province where his interest in music began. Now, he recently released his first studio album titled The Amazing Journey, and uh, he joins us this morning to share more on this. A very warm welcome, Baba. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much. Yeah, All right, now, take so us much. through uh, the album. How did it get to the point that it is in? Uh, 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 when I was a small boy, uh, I wanted to be a jazz artist. Okay. Uh, when, I, when, when we grew up, we used to listen to the radio, something uh, like Obo Prahiu, Wabo, Jonas Nguangwa, when we wake up, uh, preparing for, for, for school. Uh, so I, I grew up with that thing, Yoguti, one day I want to be a jazz artist. Mm -hmm. uh, until I went to my high school, I didn't do music at school. Uh, I went to, to, to tertiary, I, was, I, I did IT in Damelin. Okay. Then uh, after tertiary, I just went back to, to my school. Uh, I just fetched uh, some of my friends uh, whom I know that they play uh, uh, instruments. Mm -hmm. I asked them to assist me to do to, to, to my album. Uh, I did my album last year. Uh, I finished it around November. Mm -hmm. Yes, and then I started selling it on streets because I didn't have funds uh, 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 to push it. Uh, 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 although it's free to play, to, 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 for your music to be played on, uh, on radios and, and, and TV, mm -hmm. but you need fin uh, financial support to, 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 to do that thing. Yeah, so yeah. I started selling it on streets until today. I'm selling my music on street. Uh, yeah. I think that's why I'm here today because uh, I didn't sit down. I just yeah, decided that, yeah. no, I don't have money to push my music. Let me go on street. People will support me. Humble beginnings, eh? Yeah, and you're going yeah. far with that. And uh, you know, all the jazz yeah. legends started where you started. Yeah. Now tell me, uh, it, it's, it's quite rare that uh, young people follow jazz music. Like jazz music doesn't have that much of a following within the younger yeah. community. What, what inspired you to take this route? I think it's because of the radios and, 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 and the media as well. Uh, uh, because uh, jazz, uh, they only uh, play jazz on Sunday. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have that uh, uh, mentality that jazz, it's for Sunday. Right. Uh, uh, so uh, young people are interested in jazz. That's why we are able to produce this, this product. But the problem is uh, 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 the, the radios and, 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 and the media, they are, take, they, they, they are taking the young people to a certain direction. Sure. That's why they are no, uh, we are no longer producing uh, uh, jazz music. Mm -hmm. But I think uh, if, if, if radios can play jazz, uh, every show they play maybe five to five, five songs because you you, you you only find maybe Prahu played once a week in mm. a radio station. Right, so so true. so when we grew up, we used to listen to those music, uh, Jonas Ngwangwa, Prahu. That's why we are interested in jazz. Yeah. So now take I just us through your your songwriting method. What goes through your mind before uh, jotting down those lyrics? Uh, the reason why I, I, I decided to do jazz and it's because I'm politically active. Uh, okay. in, in, in the society. So there are a lot of things I want to say uh, to my people, African people, uh, through music. Because I think uh, 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 the only way to, to, to deliver the message... So you want to drive a political message, you say? Not politically, but there are a lot of things happening in our community, uh, uh, country and the world, uh, which need to be addressed. Like this thing happening of killing women uh, in, in these days. Mm. So we need to address those things. So as an artist, I thought it's better for me to deliver that message through music. Mm -hmm. not, all, uh, not, not, not any genre, but jazz. Because remember, jazz uh, 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 was, was, uh, was started by politicians. Mm. Remember Prahu, Mama, Miriam, Makeba, right, those right. are the politicians. Yeah. So that's why I decided to, 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 to do chairs. Uh, yeah, yeah. Was there a specific sound that uh, you wanted to do when you started, when you ventured into music, <laughs> or you just set out to do jazz and nothing else? No, I just, I wanted, uh, 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 I like African jazz. You will, you, you, you will hear the melodies that we play. It's more African. When you listen to those sounds, even if you are not in Africa, but it will take you back to Africa. Mm. Uh, 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 I, I, I do African jazz. My sounds okay. are, 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 are more African. Okay. Yeah, I don't do English jazz. Okay. I do local, local, local jazz. And I believe your hero is Yuma Sikela because you've been mentioning him. Right yeah, yeah, yeah. Even, even you can go through my CDs. Uh, I, I, only, I, I play that man. I, there's no <laughs> CD that I don't have. Right, yeah, right. And I wish one day we will meet uh, because uh, I don't know him mm -hmm. uh, uh, personally. Mm -hmm. Yeah, through his legacy, that's why we decided to do jazz. Well, with your determination, you'll certainly yeah. meet him, and I'm sure he's watching right now. <laughs> now, uh, you've worked with quite a few people from Sanilem Kize, Mvelo Pagati. How did you meet up, and uh, what did you get up to? 
Uh, let me start by Mvelo Parati. Uh, we were at the same school. I was a motivation speaker at school, so, so, so he was a pianist at school. Mm -hmm. So most of the time we used to be together because every Sunday we used to, we used to have a... A, a, a service. Mm -hmm. So I used to motivate a, a, a students at school. I was studying at Similar as a Comtech. Okay. Uh, and he was a pianist there. So that's how we connected. Mm -hmm. Then then after tertiary, I just called him. That's hey, my friend, I need to do my album. I'm interested now in doing music. Can you assist me? And then he came and assisted me. These people, they charge. But he did, he, he, assisted, me, he, he assisted me to, to do that uh, album free of charge. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that's why I decided to, no, let me go back to school and fetch for those guys that I know because it's, it's, it's expensive to do jazz. I can jazz. imagine, yeah. Yeah, it's yeah. expensive. I won't lie to you because you, 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 you end up doing one song with seven people playing different uh, instruments mm. and all those people, they, they pay them. Paid. Yeah, they Before he opens his case, mm. you pay him. Mm, mm. And they, so it's very expensive. That's Charging why young people, yes. For that's everybody, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why young people don't take that direction. Uh, 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 because it's not just a computer engine. When you compose these things, it's not just a... It's far uh, more than it's, that. Yeah, yeah, There's yeah, so much yeah, to be done. Yeah. All right, there are a so lot yeah, of that, instruments there. All right, all the best in music, and thank you so much for coming through. Eh? <laughs> thank you so much. All right, that was Asiyanda Lamin, an artist from KZN, just sharing more on his album titled Amazing Journey. Well,